In this tutorial I'll be showing you how to modify an existing style set in Microsoft Word. If you haven't used styles before, I'd suggest taking a look at our styles and style set video as part of the formatting your thesis series, but for this walkthrough I'll presume that you've already gone through that one. So as you can see I have told Microsoft Word where my title, my subtitles and my headings are, I've identified a quote here in the system as well, and I've already gone into the design tab and chosen a style design as well. Now this looks great, however for your thesis you need to make sure that it fulfills the guidelines in terms of font size, um, font type etc that you're going to need when you submit your thesis. So to do this we need to modify the style that we've chosen and that's going to be done using this style tab up at the top. Now you've already told Word where all the different elements within your document are so you don't need to do that again, you just need to go into them in this tab. So if I go to normal and this is going to affect your paragraph text and right click you'll see we have the option to modify. If you click on modify you'll have a new pop-up window that appears and on the bottom left there's a button that says format. When you click format you have lots of different options in terms of things that you can change about the style of your normal text. But I'm going to start by just going into the font and telling it that we need Arial and size 12 and I click OK and OK again and you can see that the font in all of the paragraphs throughout the document has changed to Arial size 12. So this is a really easy way to make sure that your document is formatted in the same way all the way through. Let's do that again. Um, another thing that you would need to fit in with the guidelines is your headings need to be size 16 and in Arial as well. So if I modify this again, go to the format button and click on font and I will choose Arial again and size 16 this time and click OK and OK. And you can see that these have now all changed to size 16 and the other element which I haven't had to change um, is that your headings need to be in all caps to fit in with those guidelines. And that's it. That's how you modify the different elements of a style that you're using in Microsoft Word.